some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we will be going down another sovereign citizen rabbit hole and see what we can find. Will we find out the uh, secret to the universe, or will we just find more stupidity? Stick around and find out. In the meantime, let's just go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Well, did I commit any crimes well, or do sir, anything wrong? I don't want to argue with you about that. The reason I'm talking to you... I don't want to argue okay. with you at all, well, just so you know. I absolutely do not okay. want to Good. argue with anybody. I, yeah, I, I, um, based on everything I observed with the tag in Ohio Revised Code, that would be a fraudulent tag. You would need to have it registered with the state of Ohio. Unless you have paperwork to document that plate, um, that's what I'm asking for. Do you have an ID I can get? Well, I do have an ID I can give. I, I do have an ID. I also have, you know, I've been studying a lot on the Constitution. Oh, I shudder to think about how much you have studied the Constitution. You've probably only studied it for like two minutes. So you probably don't know jack squat about it anyway. So let's go ahead and find out how much you actually know. I'm quite interested. And some of the rules and regulations and whatnot. And I really I really don't want to debate with you, with you any more than you want to debate with me. Well, if you're so confident about everything that you know, why don't you just go ahead and debate them? I want to see how well your debate skills are, especially if you think you know the Constitution like you say you do. So let's get back to it, shall we? I want to see this epicness. You know, because sure quite honestly... I feel that I'm completely just. I'm traveling. Okay. I'm not driving. I'm not operating a vehicle. I'm not a commercial operator. I'm just. Not, I'm just. A vehicle? I'm. I'm just traveling. Okay. This. This is according to. According to. I mean, I have several case laws from the Constitution that talks about. Do you, you have any weapons you know, in the vehicle? I have no weapons okay, whatsoever. Great. Oh, soft heart, you are beginning to disappoint me. Considering you are presenting the same tired old arguments that I've heard a thousand others spew off. I mean, can you give me something new? Something new to work with? Come on now, uh, I know you can do it. Um, do I'm not. ID? I'm not a threat to anybody. Okay, great. You, you myself. Uh, your ID in the wall in your left pocket. Yeah. Can you grab it for me? I'm just going to walk around so I can talk to you a little easier. That makes it easier. Wait a second. You're wanting to make it easier on this officer? I thought the whole existence of you sovereign citizens was to make the officer's life that much harder. But you are a contradiction here. I pulled over to this the kind of street to keep you off the road there. Oh, that's not my credit card. That Sorry, I don't take credit. You don't take credit. All right. Thank you, sir. 547 11. Check's okay. Can you run an Ohio DL, Robert Zebra, 725-614 in Dennis Roads? All right. Okay. Do you have insurance on this? Yes. Can you show me that? Yes. Where are you from? I'm from this neighborhood. Oh, okay. Cool. Right on. Really? Seriously? You've got a driver's license and insurance? Yeah, uh, you are a disappointment as far as soft tards go. I mean, uh, I don't know what to think anymore. Disappointed! Were you in the Marines? Yes, sir. What did you do in the Marines? Eighth Motor Transport Battalion, also marksmanship instructor, okay. and a couple other things. I did a lot in my, just my short bit of time. Yes. Do you know? I'll be out here. Now I, like I do construction type yeah. stuff here and there. Okay. Okay. Well, thank you for your service. Uh, your license is valid through Ohio. Well, of course. Um, I have. Would you consider yourself a constitutionalist? Yes, sir. Okay. So there's nothing wrong with that. Um, I have ran into people who are constitutionalists that destroy all their identification, through, no. and it makes our job extremely difficult. No, I'm not. I've never dealt you know, with you before. So it, it gets it gets it gets tricky in things, and and there's a lot of stuff I'm still learning and working my way through. But uh, yeah, I'm I'm, I'm truly. Oh, uh, you're conducting yourself now is what I would. That no issues with uh, the registration, you're going to get a ticket for it. You, you have to have an Ohio registration. Uh, that would be something you could dispute with the court. Sure. Um, I understand. For us, if we can't run the registration, do you care if I, I check your VIN number? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, you, this is like a. Uh,
You know what? I'm beginning to think that this guy is not a militant uh, Savtard. Uh, he's just beginning his journey down that rabbit hole. So there might be still some hope left for him yet. Thank you. Oh, Alvarado, this, do you mind just keeping your hands on the steering wheel for me? Thank you. You're good. Thank you. Trucks. I have. Cool. You your uh, I was with the People's Convoy when the People's Convoy rode through from California. Spent about six months driving around the country trying to fight for freedom and share. Right on. Yeah, no, I saw some of the stuff on the back. I tried to kind of read some. Do you care to show me what you got? No. Explain, like, I, the more you teach me, the more I learn from your. Opinion. Well, if you, it is, you need to get it going, is, it I'm is, willing I, to learn. I don't. I don't have any. I don't have anywhere to go. Yeah. You know, um, you know, I mean, I definitely, I definitely know I don't want to put myself in a position where I put you in a position that, that I say something that makes you feel like you have to do anything more than. I'm not trying to arrest you at all. Is there any weapons you do have? I have no weapons. Sweet. I have no weapons. Me, like, what you have on your truck just to educate me for. You mean as far as my writings yeah, and yeah, whatnot? Yeah, that's all it is. You're okay. not, I'm not, I'm not even going to have. Well, I'll tell you one of the, one of the, my favorite books so far outside the Constitution of the United States is this book right here. And this book talks in the law into the different, there's different jurisdictions of law. Okay. For example, you know, you work for a corporation, right? I work for the state of Ohio. The state of Ohio, which is a corporation. We made the right and another right on, I guess it's Shack or something. Yeah, I don't know the name of the road. Uh, oh, I can tell you. It's uh, just off Forge Drive. Yes. Okay, got it. Um, but yeah, no, do you care to show me? And that way I can learn. I'm not trying to uh, do anything further. Sure. Yeah. Hey, you know. Hey, the more I learn, the more it makes everyone be able to talk and communicate. You drop your, uh, thank you. Okay, perhaps I was mistaken because it appears that he's gone a little bit further down the rabbit hole than it first appeared. Because you know what? States are not corporations. And if you learn that, that they're not corporations and actually study what a corporation is, perhaps you will not go further down the rabbit hole. Because you know what? It's very dark down there, and you don't know what kind of scary things are in there. <laughs> well, I finally got pulled over. Got to get my ticket. The office is really nice, and I did tell him. I said, I don't know if you heard, but uh, I'm going to keep these plates on here until I go to court. I don't care if I get another ticket or not, because I feel that I'm right. And um, we'll see what happens. It's tough, tough for now. Yeah, let me know how that works out for you. Considering I've seen so many soft tarred videos in court, they all do face plants as soon as they open their mouths. All right, Mr. Rhodes. Um, so it just needs to be taken care of by the 29th, either by paying it out or going to court. Yeah. Uh, it's going to be in Lebanon Municipal Court. And then your insurance back. I highlighted the typo that they have. Thank it's you. 918. It's supposed to be 818. Okay. And then also doesn't really matter but it probably wants to get fixed if you need mail it's going to be eleven inch, not left in <laughs> right so right. there's the citation do you have any questions for me no no um no in theory we could tow your vehicle i'm not going to do that but yeah uh, how i would say you need a registered vehicle to uh, right. drive on a public road so. i know that uh i know that that does happen to some people that are in my situation yeah, no, I appreciate and then they go and then they go to court and sometimes they win sometimes they lose 
It's um, really not worth it at the end. Of, but I understand you have your stance, and uh, it's respectful. Yeah. But I appreciate you being respectful back. Oh, well, you know, I, I there's there's you. no sense. I mean, we're 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 equals. Yeah, we're all Americans. Just uh, try to do our job and. Absolutely, okay. absolutely. But if you ever want to look into it, I mean, if you look up, the U.S. Supreme Court says no license, license there to drive an automobile on public roads. Okay. It also goes into something, you know, other things as far as personal travel goes. Ah, you know, right. uh, yes, the standard soft hard case rulings that don't actually say what you think they say. It's just constitutional rights. Okay. Um, I appreciate and it. I'm, I'm, I'm tired of having stuff taken away. I've been fighting with... Um, you know, I'll tell you, I went down to, uh, when this all started two years ago, at first I was scared just like everybody else of COVID. Mm -hmm. I had gotten sick real bad, and then they announced COVID, and I thought, oh, crap, if I get COVID now, I'm a goner, because what right. I just had hurt me pretty bad. Yeah. Well, shortly after, I started paying more attention to things, noticing things, and, and I went to the health commissioner, and I shared with him a whole bunch of stuff that is very obvious and blatant yeah. as far as concern for people and, and my, my fellow mankind around me. And after I went through a stack of papers that he couldn't contest anything on, mm. all he could say was he's not concerned. Yeah. And so, you know, there's real criminals in the world, in my opinion, that really aren't doing their jobs and taking care of people the way they should be. Yeah. I've never yeah, had a bad right. problem with law enforcement yeah. before, and I hope never to have a bad problem. Yeah, definitely. But, um, so I appreciate being polite, um, and uh, have a safe day, okay? All Just right. Make sure you get that court taken care of, either paying it out or going for it. All right. Thank you. Well, I'll give credit where credit is due. This soft heart was actually quite pleasant and nice. Not like a lot of the other ones you see hanging around. They're all bitter and nasty. And, uh, well, they end up getting put in the back of a squad car because of their dirty, rotten personalities that, well, quite frankly, I wouldn't want to be around anyway. At any rate, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. And I will see you on the next one.